Team is up early, bringing you more news stories. 100 years ago, it was named the Moses Cleveland Tree in honor of Cleveland's founder. But now that tree is coming down. However, the E-Team community reporter Lauren Wilson learned how part of it will still live on. It's like a funeral, this Moses Cleveland tree here in Lakewood seeing its last days, but death is only the beginning. I mean, the tree was coming down and I wanted to get a few pictures before it does. Holding onto a memory. And have a piece of Lakewood history. History that won't fade away once the decayed tree is cut down, thanks to these guys. So you basically take a small sapling, cut it off, and then graft it in. Grafting, a process John Palmer and Charles Tubasing will use to preserve the tree. The whole goal is to essentially vegetatively propagate or clone that tree to produce a tree that's essentially the same thing. We can memorialize it all over Lakewood, I hope. Now the tree is set to come down tomorrow if the weather cooperates. As far as the grafting process goes, I'm told it'll take about four to five years until the new trees are ready to be planted. For the E-Team, I'm Lauren Wilson. Yeah, the landscape looks